When he first arrived, it was really difficult to get him to eat, so we were have to like we were syringe feeding him, and even with a syringe, he was very very reluctant to eat. And I mean, he was this size; he was so tiny and so frail. Picking him up was terrifying because he was just so little. Um, he fit into the palm of your hand, and he'd shiver, and it was, oh, it was awful. Um, so he came in because I think he was so small. He wasn't eating. He wasn't drinking. He wasn't able. To, he wasn't very balanced. He was finding everything really, really difficult. And then, because his siblings were all fighting fit, he wasn't able to get access to any of Mum's milk. So it really was quite a crucial thing that he was brought into us, where we could offer him 24/7 hour care. Uh, he was able to go home with one of the vet nurses initially. So she had a really, really keen eye on him throughout the day, writing you know, what he was getting up to, how he was. I think the care that we offered Kevin gave him a life. If we weren't there, if we weren't you know, accessible and gave him all of this love, attention and medical care 24 hours a day, I think it would have been a, a bleak story for Kevin, I really do. And um, it was really lucky that we intervened and had the support and had the knowledge to be able to help him so quickly and get him to that fighting fit stage. Kevin? Ah.